I want to welcome uh, President uh, Ben Sen to the United States of America and to the Oval Office. Uh, last year, I was proud to uh, make a historic visit uh, to Myanmar as the first uh, U.S. president uh, ever to uh, visit that country. Uh, and now, uh, President uh, Sen is able to uh, uh, return the favor by making a visit to the United States. And my understanding is that this is the first uh, visit by a leader of Myanmar in uh, almost 50 years. Uh, obviously, during this period uh, in between, uh, there have been significant bilateral tensions uh, between our countries. Uh, but what has allowed uh, this uh, shift in relations is the leadership that uh, President uh, Sain uh, has uh, shown uh, in moving Myanmar down a path of both political and economic reform. Uh, over uh, the last two years, we've seen uh, a steady process in which uh, political uh, prisoners, including uh, Anyang Suu Kyi, uh, have been released uh, and have been incorporated uh, into the political process. Uh, we've seen uh, credible elections uh, and a legislature that uh, is continuing to make strides in the direction of uh, more inclusivity and uh, uh, greater representation of all the various groups uh, within Myanmar. Uh, President Sain has also made uh, genuine efforts to resolve long-standing ethnic conflicts within the country. Uh, and has recognized the need to establish laws uh, that respect uh, the rights of the people of Myanmar. Uh, as a consequence of these changes in policy inside of Myanmar, uh, the United States has been able to uh, relax uh, sanctions that uh, had been placed on Myanmar, and uh, many countries uh, around the world have followed suit.